Well, people who are overweight certainly have a higher risk than others, and that's especially the knee joint, and that's because of the increased load. And there's been studies to show that if you lose a pound of weight, there's about a fourfold decreased load in the knee. So people who are overweight, including you know diabetes and high blood pressure, being in there, you know, at high risk for you know osteoarthritis or something else, they should be considering. So weight loss is really important. If you've had a uh, traumatic injury to a joint, you're more likely to have you know, damage that accumulates over time and increased risk for osteoarthritis in that joint. Osteoarthritis can run in families, and especially people with hand osteoarthritis, they might say that their mother's hands look like theirs. So if they've had a family member with a particularly significant osteoarthritis, particularly in the hand, they might have noticed that, that they may be at higher risk as well. Well, water-based exercise is a really good place if you've got arthritis in your knees or your lower extremities. So it's a way of being able to um, you know, exercise without putting a lot of load on your joints. Now, some people don't like the pool, and they don't have to know how to swim. They sh you know, can uh, walk in water and do other aerobic exercises in water. But if they don't like um, the, the pool, then the other things that you know, some people have tried and have been fine and helpful is Tai Chi. Um, yoga, you know, those are things that may help um, strengthen the muscles, keep their balance, as well as be low impact.